Hi, this is Piero, Technical Director of Setpoint. I'm here with firmware 59 of the Protector. In this firmware, we have added some new customizable RBLs. RBLs can be customized in menu Anti Spam, Listings. Here, click on Repetition Block Lists and Advanced. This list contains standard and custom RBLs. The RBLs that have been added are at the bottom of the lists. They are all sorable RBLs that you can see in this list. I remind you that every RBL has a default score, which can be changed for each RBL clicking on the RBL name here or automatically for all RBLs at once, setting the sensitivity level in the main RBL page. A number of changes have also been done to the Mail Archiver. To open it, go to Mail Archiver message listing. Now it is possible to view the message header, which is shown in the message detail page. To view it, open the message listing, then select the message of your choice and click on the square brackets on the left. Another change is in the way the protector white and block lists senders. Since the field from of the message can be forked, starting with this firmware, each time an email address or domain is white or block listed, the envelope sender domain or address will be used instead of the domain or address that you can read in the from field. For example, if we want to block list this message where clearly the envelope sender and the from field have different domain names. If we click to block list the domain, the domain in the envelope sender will be added to the block list. If you want to read more about firmware 59 of the protector, I invite you to download the release notes document from our website. It's all for now, thank you for watching this video and see you with the next release from SecPoint. Bye-bye.